Mark Lehman. What? Who? Is startled awake to find himself alone and scared and pudgy. Pudgy? The hell? Bill? But there was no sign of Bill Lowe, the show's title character. Title character? What did you do with him? What? No. If I, you hurt him! No, I didn't. I'm just the voiceover guy. Bill hired me. Hired? Voice? How is this a job? Also, how is this possible? He said, without any idea what was about to happen. What's about to happen? The title card. I am going to kill him. He said, under his breath. Bill! <laughs> he growled the question of fury. What are your thoughts on plaid? No, no. Don't be cute and deflect. He demanded after slamming his adorable roommate's laptop. You seem upset, Mark. Why is there a voiceover following me? Mark asked his best and only friend. I thought you'd like it. Why would I like an invisible voiceover narrating everything I do? He said with a befuddled anxiety. Quiet! Mark rudely demanded. You're always complaining about how boring and mundane your life is. I have never said that, nor have I felt that way, lied Mark. Oh, well, I did. Just try and think about how interesting your life would be with voiceover following you everywhere you go. Mark pondered that brilliant thought. <sighs> Mark sighed, realizing that the P90X plan wasn't yielding any results for him. Hey! Yeah, no, I'd like the crab rangoon and the cheese wonton. He said, knowing he'd later regret it before his MSG-induced nap. On second thought, can I get the steamed chicken and broccoli? Yes, cheese on the side. I'd like to bounce a pack of quarters off of that. What was that? No, 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 see, it's his voice. He just likes to follow me and sometimes it says, I swear. Hey! I hate people like you! Always ruining my mind! All I want to do is just go exercise and yes, you have to be a pig! I think he's unconscious. Who's there? You are really obsessed with your weight, aren't you? Where'd that door come from? I don't know. I thought that was a storage closet. How have we lived here this long and never seen that before? Mark said just before he and Bill forgot ever seeing it in the first place and went back to doing whatever it was they were about to do. Nope! Oh, an adventure at home. Goody. Stench. It smells like a spoiled salad bar at Comic-Con. What is this? He asked, ignoring the voice inside the closet. Hello. Bill, is this the guy that you hired? I put an ad on Craigslist. The fact that the guy who took the job happened to live in the secret Narnia door next to our bathroom? I can't do that kind of math. Or any. If I skip the how and the why you're here, will you just leave? No, no, no you, you can't kick me out. He is right, Mark. You were always picked last for kickball. No, no, I, I'm i an agoraphobe. You can't say that, I have gay dads! No, no, no. It it means I'm afraid of the outdoors and, and human contact and... I don't have a third thing, but when my roommates moved out, I couldn't leave, so I just stayed here and put the room up for rent. This was listed as a one bedroom with no roommates. I was gonna get around to introducing myself. I just- You moved in four months ago. You're still gonna pay me, right?
My name is Rory. You know, since you asked and all. I know how to bake. You know how to make cake pops? Uh, no. Oh. I can learn. Poop, 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 shut poop, up, poop.